So hi mga kaps, kumusta? Sana sa muting kalagayan at malulusoy pa ng atawan. Hello! Another video na naman tayo. Mukhang nagkakalat na naman si Kong Alvarez, si Pantalyon Alvarez. Kung ano-ano na naman ang, sinisi, ang sinisisi sa baha, sa Dabao, eh ang administrasyon Marcos. Ha? Bakit mo sinisisi ang administrasyon? Ano? Ha? Bakit nung ikaw ang nakaupong speaker at isa ka sa mga um, kasamahan ng dating Pangulong Duterte, ano ang ginawa nyo para i-improve ha, ang Dabao para maiwasan ang mga bahang ito na nangyayari ngayon? Ano ang ginawa nyo? Ha? Kung sa time ninyo inayos nyo na itong problema ng ito, walang bahang mangyayari. Bakit nyo sinisisi ang administrasyon ng ating mahal na Pangulong Marcos? Ha? Ano ang ginawa nyo para pigilan ito? Puro kayo paninira. Ha? Humahanap kayo ng scapegoat. Ha? Humahanap kayo ng scapegoat. Ito, pakinggan nyo ang sinabi ni Sir uh, Erwin Tulfo patungkol sa issue nito ni uh, Pantalyon Alvarez. Ito po ang video. <tinyo> Um, I think it was last week when I had Congressman Alvarez on the program, former Speaker of the House. You know what's happening in the Davao region, the flooding, the landslides, and he's pointing to the current Congress, to the current House of Representatives, as, and his words logically, to be blamed for the flooding and landslides that, ha landslides that are happening there. He's saying there were certain projects, flood control programs, that were stopped by the current House of Representatives. Do you know anything about this? Is there any truth to his claims? I wish I can uh, give you the answer, Ms. Carmina, but I'm not part of the appropriations, actually. So uh, I cannot give you a complete or concrete answer regarding uh, the accusations of uh, Congressman Alvarez with the current administration. All I know, all I know, na, because I joined late uh, this Congress, uh, I joined like around September, October already. So I am not very sure. But talking about the uh, 2024 budget, I believe all, all of our... Uh, Congressmen will get their uh, budget that uh, they were requesting for for their constituents for their respective districts. I, I'm not uh, really privy to that. Mm -hmm. If you want, I may ask uh, people in the appropriations to see and verify the veracity of this accusation or report of uh, Congressman Alvarez. We, I mean, yeah. I can uh, get back to you. Yeah, we, we, and we're going to really appreciate that. But do you think it's fair, Congressman Tulfo, to blame the current House of Representatives for the flooding and landslide that's currently happening in the region, given that the congressman has been in power? even being a speaker at one point um, for, for, for a long time already. Go ahead, Congressman. Your the thoughts. flooding has been there, I believe, Ms. Carmina, even uh, during the time of Pinoy. It's been uh, happening already in Davao, not only in Davao City, but the entire... 20,000 loan payable. So, ano mas sabi niyo mga kap sa sinabi ni Sir Erwin Tulfo patungkol sa issue ni Pantalyon Alvarez. Comment daw bilang mga kap, so, huwag niyo to mag-like, share, and subscribe. Para sa akin, talagang escape goat na lang to. Alam niyo naman kung sino nag-uutos niyan para siraan ang administrasyon Marcos ngayon sa patungkol sa bahang ito. Alam niyo naman, sino ba ang bossing ng taong ito? Ha? Comment down below. Susunod na video mga caps.